What's up, guys? So is Elon Musk the new Donald Trump? I, I think he is, ladies and gentlemen. A uh, couple of days ago, now for those of you that don't know, Twitter is based in San Fran shithole, uh, California. Okay? Now, I don't know if you, and yeah, I said it, by the way. And if you've never been out there, uh, <laughs> oh my gosh. Anyways, he was on stage. Elon Musk came out on stage with Dave Chappelle. Dave Chappelle did some kind of comedy show or something. And these people had the audacity to boo Elon Musk. Now, uh, I don't know if you guys know this or not, but he was the champion uh, for the for the Blue Party before he bought Twitter. You know, he's all for, you know, the solar stuff and, <clears throat> you know, climate change and, you know, helping out the environment with the electric vehicles and stuff like that. But uh, because he's doing what he's doing now, and plus Trump's not around, it seems like this party, for some reason, has to have somebody be a villain. And nobody better uh, right now than Elon Musk. I mean, the tweet he came out with about basically prosecute Fauci, um, he's not saying that for no reason, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, he's, he's, he's bringing out the Twitter files. I think we're on number five now. And this, these are going to go down in history, by the way. Which the mainstream media, or the lamestream media, I like to call them, are still not covering. And now... The the uh, the FBI or the feds or whatever are looking into Elon Musk's businesses. I wonder why. I wonder why they're all of a sudden looking at his business. And you think that the lamestream media is not covering this because they didn't cover the other stuff. The Twitter file, that was a nothing burger to them. But now all of a sudden they're going to cover this. I tell you, man, we, we live in a uh, crazy world. And let me say this, we've always lived in this world. It's just now we're discovering it. It's so funny how, you know, I, I, I may do this, talk about this in another video, but basically it's like this. This phone right here that, that I'm recording on, these things should be about between 10,000 at the minimum to 100,000 bucks. You can do everything with these with these phones. You know, I, I mean, you you list it, you, you can do it. But now all of a sudden, with all these quote unquote smartphones, people are dumber than they were before the smartphones. Isn't that something? So may, basically saying your phone is smarter than you and it's making you dumber. But I'll, I'll, I'll talk about that in another video. Elon Musk is the new Donald Trump. They have to vilify somebody over, over in that party over there. <clears throat> and let me say something. I love all Americans. I, I love them all. <clears throat> Excuse me. Regardless of how they think, how crazy they are, it's all about the brainwashing. You know, and I, and I got to watch myself because I'm, I'm getting ready to say some things that I cannot say on here. I'm, I'm going to start a rumble channel too, guys, because, uh, it, human beings have an innate ability to see in the future. And I see my future. Let me, I, I, I see my future. I think I'm going to get canceled on YouTube. I, I, I can just see it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why. So I'm going to have to have a backup and I'm going to, I'm going to go on rumble. But anyways, um, I'm just all over the place. Uh, I, I just cannot believe what's going on in, t in today's society with uh, the American people getting bamboozled. And, it, and it's and we're all being controlled by the people uh, that you know who is controlling us. And, you know, when you're talking about watching a television program, it literally is a program. We, we, we have been and still are being programmed. And there's not a lot of people that are awake. And I'm on a mission, ladies and gentlemen. I'm on a mission uh, to, to to help wake people up. I, I really want to do that. I just want us to live in harmony and peace. And like the Constitution is, says, um, you know, have our rights, you know, the pursuit of happiness, you know, the pursuit of happiness, life, liberty, freedom. All those things that the Constitution says and our forefathers uh, died for to get us here uh, to this point. And now they're, they're trying to destroy our Constitution. So uh, it's not these people's fault. The people that are, you know, a lot of these people that are on the left and some on the right, um, they're crazy because they've been programmed to be that way. And it's our job. It's almost like you're, they're zombies or something, you know, but we can turn them around. So instead of us arguing with them, we, we need to. Help them out. But anyways, I digress. Elon Musk. They're looking all into his businesses. Listen, man, you are taking a big risk as as Elon Musk is taking. When you go against a machine, 
uh, and ha and as much power he ha as he has, um, he's he's nothing compared to to those people. Okay, let me say that Elon Musk is not the richest man in the world. Okay, he's one of the richest men that we know about. Of course, he has plenty of resources, plenty of money. He's not the richest man in the world. Okay, uh, you don't believe me? Don't believe me? Look it up. Okay. So now the Twitter files are coming out and we already know the COVID stuff is, is going to be absolutely jaw dropping. Not to me and you, we already know. Uh, but to, to the people that are going to be denying it and, and put Fauci up there like he's, you know, he's Jesus or something are going to be so shocked, not because it's the truth, because they're, they're not going to try to accept the truth. And it's a funny thing about human beings. Anyways. Um, they're going to try to deny it instead of saying, hmm, maybe I'm wrong. See, the, the type of person that I am, and I know you guys are like this too, we look for the truth. We don't look for what we want it to be. We look for the truth, regardless of the outcome or what it is. That's what you have to do. So with Elon Musk, what he's doing, I commend him. It's so crazy because this man is more of a moderate or in the middle than anybody I've ever seen. Guys, he voted for Joe Biden. Do you guys know that? But if you listen to the left, uh, he he's Hitler now. He's he's worse than Donald Trump. He his 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 ideals aligned completely with them. But when he discovers the truth, like any human rational human being should, they say, "Well, maybe I was wrong." It doesn't matter who's in charge. It's all about what are they doing while they're in charge. It doesn't matter if you don't like them or not. Because trust and believe, if the other guy that used to be our president was in charge now and the economy and everything was going on the way they was going on and list and list the 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 enormous things bad things that this current administration has done let's just say the guy that was in there before did 10 percent of that stuff what do you think they'd be saying i'm not saying he's perfect he's far from it uh <laughs> but we already know okay we're not stupid but if you say you like him the other guy oh you're a trumper this that Anyways, Elon Musk is, I love him because he's a truth teller. Is he perfect? No. By the way, do you know anybody that's perfect? I don't. I don't look for anybody who's perfect. I look for the best person for the job or whatever that job is and see if they can do it. You can find imperfections on anybody. The problem is when you're on the other side of the aisle and the other person on the other side goes against you or whatever and has different policies and they run for that office and all of a sudden all they do is look for the for the bad stuff instead of saying hmm let me put america first not my party let me put the Amer let me put america first and forget about the bad stuff let's focus on the good and work together but they don't do it everything in this country is divided the states are divided the laws are divided the congress is divided uh everything's divided where are we united at in this in this country you can't even sit down at a, at a dinner table with your family Shout out to you. And talk uh, uh, about politics anymore. You can't do it. You can't talk about politics or religion. It's always been taboo. But anyways, Elon Musk, uh, I, I I admire that man. Um, but because he's not absolutely with the left and doing everything you say, because even the left, the left people that are, are hardcore lefties that go against a little bit against uh what they do, they'll 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 ban them. They'll kick them out. They'll they'll silence them. You know what I mean? Look at look what happened to Trevor Noah. Do you, do you know why he left that that news station and that and that thing? Do your research. Let's just say uh, he told the truth about some things. Okay, that's all he did, and now he has to go. Hmm. I wonder why. Uh, this stuff is not on accident, ladies and gentlemen. Elon Musk. I cannot wait to see over the next few weeks, few months, uh, what this man is going to do with Twitter. Uh, this man needs to be protected at all times because all he's doing, he's not on the right. He's not uh, an extremist, uh, you know, Nazi or, you know, this, that, and the third. He is an American, an African-American uh, that's in America now that wants free speech for everybody and wants the truth to be out, regardless of what you do or don't like. So Elon Musk, I commend you. And uh, that man needs to be protected at all times. And uh, let's see what happens over the next few months. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, I got a few more videos I'm going to do. I'm going to do some trending topics. 
Uh, you guys ask for it, I'm gonna give it to you. But I'm, I'm telling you, uh, I'm gonna hurt some people's feelings sometimes. But hey, I got, I got, I got to do it. You know what I mean? So, no edits. So it's straight raw to y'all. All right, Elon Musk, you're the man. Period. Point blank. You are the man, and you are very brave for doing what you're doing, man. And he needs to be protected at all times. So I'll talk to you guys soon. Stay tuned for the next one. All right. Peace and love, guys.